Hi everyone. It's October, which means Halloween is coming up. My favourite part of Halloween is the costumes. See my friends here? Do you know what they're dressed up as? That's right. Carrot is a vampire. Watermelon is a wizard. And Pumpkin is a witch. What are you going to dress up as this year? Get your parents to help you tell us in the comments. Now, I also love spooky Halloween stories. So I'm going to tell you one. Don't get too scared, alright? It's just a story. This is part one of the lady at the end of the street. It was Halloween night and three friends were all dressed up, ready to go trick or treating. It was their first time going on their own. They were very excited, also a little bit nervous. Halloween was the scariest night of the year. What if they saw a black cat? Or witches? Or what happened if they got bad candy? Ew, gross. But their parents told them everything would be fine, just as long as they followed three rules. One, don't stray from the path. Two, don't bother the lady at the end of the street. And three, don't go into the forest. So, the three friends took the map from their parents and set out on their way. They went house to house knocking and yelling, trick or treat, and showing off their costumes. Their bags were about half full of candy when they started getting a little bit bored. Sure, they were getting good candy, that was great. But Halloween was supposed to be scary, and this wasn't scary at all. They were a little disappointed. But all of a sudden, they heard a yowl coming from the bushes, and they decided to go and check it out. After all, it was just a little way off their path. They went over and looked at the bush, and looking right back at them was a big green pair of eyes. They didn't know what it was. What could it be? An alien? Maybe a monster? They didn't know. But what they did know was that Halloween was becoming more exciting than they had even hoped. Ooh, scary. And that's where we're gonna leave our story for today. To whom do you think those big green eyes belong? Get your parents to help you write your guesses in the comments. Hit like if you enjoyed part one and look out for part two of The Lady at the End of the Street.